guys what's up capricorn thanks for watching appreciate it it's gonna be a reading for your media future the situation and the obstacles in your way and the outcome of that situation so keep in mind that the energies can go both ways this could be your energy or the oh shit the energy of the person you're dealing with somebody around you so flip it how you need to also remember it's a general reading so just take what's yours leave the rest behind all right that was a whole lot of lovey-dovey feelings when i was reading I mean, when i was shuffling and then this is something else so hopefully you're about to come into the energy that was there when i was shuffling and not that bottom one usually that bottom one is not uh upcoming all right well there's a couple of those cards the knight of swords the five of wands the six of pentacles i mean overall it's like the way somebody communicates or the way like it could just be the way something like the quickness the swiftness something moves forward it feels like i don't know if this is like drama like on the 3d level but but it's it's some type of conflict that's here and it feels like either because of like the way communication is coming across or the swiftness of in which something is happening show me this knight of swords for capricorn please the knight of wands Whew. yeah two extremely fast energies you could have two people here um, there could be an age difference or like young. When I say young, I mean like, uh, younger 20s, upper teens, like 18, 19. I mean, this is a fit, really feel good energy. The sun's at the bottom. Could be dealing with a Cancer Scorpio Pisces here. Uh, it just, it really feels like, unless you have two people coming towards you, um, it's just, this Knight of Wands is a very carefree energy. And with this Nine of Cups, that's wish fulfillment, that's like a lot of ecstaticness here. Like, but it's, something about it is really taking off quick. Nothing about it is coming off as negative. What's going on for Capricorn? No oh, shoot, okay. I don't want all these. Oh, so it's almost like somebody is, okay, two ways. Either somebody's been quiet, like a situation that has not been moving, and it's been moving, but just incredibly slow, so it possibly didn't feel like it was moving. And this has to do with um, someone that you have feelings for. Uh, they have feelings for you as well, but it's kind of like slowly emerging or it's been slowly merging but then like i think this kind of just shocks you and makes you incredibly happy give me one more for capricorn for this situation the four of wands king of cups again at the bottom um you may have been more focused on career lately possibly trying to save up some money something like that but with the four of wands that's um this could be like something around your home uh something around a marriage it's just a whole lot of like carefree energy but it's like it kind of just comes in quick and it could come with communication it could be like a party for some of you something that you're celebrating all these pictures have like this celebration effect and it's not even like in literal terms because i guess it could diff be different for each but it all stems from one like swift quick movement here show me this five of wands because this is something that could have been like a home a family a long-term commitment it could just be even around friends like a friendship maybe somebody that you know you've known for a long time um whatever this is it looked like you know something may have been like a little standoffish there in the background if that's the case that doesn't have to be the case for all 
just something here is about to take off so damn quick i don't even feel like you see it so anyways with the four of wands and the five of wands someone's trying to compete for that like sometimes when you get to a place of stability here um you know sometimes you gotta fight for that so i mean for some it could be a home but with the seven of wands it feels like somebody wants to protect it whereas you know some things could have been I don't know, like a little pushback or resistant there. Show me that Seven of Wands. The Hierophant, that's Taurus energy. Somebody could have really wanted stability, like monogamy. It's something that was higher than just like ordinary, you know, high and buy things. This feels like, like something's just rushing in and I don't even think you feel it. And it feels, whoa. The Hierophant and the High Priestess. That's, that's, um, for some. For some, that's like, um, not for all. That could have to do with, like, if, if somebody's parents are, like, extremely, or, like, or come from religious family or religious background, for some, that could have been the conflict. But for others, it feels like you kind of kept a lot in. Like, there's a lot. You're just... I don't know. It's almost like you're kind of just... I don't want to say sucking up. Because that doesn't even make sense. The world and the high priestess. I mean, not the high priestess. The queen of cups. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, energy. The world is your energy here. Yeah, see, there was something here that was like, uh, wasn't, it, it could have hurt. Whatever the situation was, um, it, it, it caused some type of conflict. It caused some type of pain here. But now that's changing. Things are opening up. It's like a change of energies here. Moving on from some type of pain. It could be traveling, could be moving. Show me the Six of Pentacles for Capricorn, please. It's a lot of spirituality around this. And your intuition, like your third eye, is crazy high right now. So you, whoo. Look at that. This is going to be so different for each. Because this doesn't even just have to do with like a love situation. Um... You're making something happen here. Uh, with the Magician, the Six of Cups, and the Six of Pentacles. I don't know if there was like a choice or some type of, not really stagnation, but there was some type of conflict that like was blocking you from moving forward towards what you want. This could be something creative that you're doing. This also could have um, definitely be around like a love situation that hurt you. You know, maybe somebody was in and out or you know there was some type of drama or it was just really hard trying to communicate there the six of cups and the six of pentacles you're manifesting let me clarify that six of pentacles because i see that seven of swords at the bottom of the deck it's supposed to be something that's equal give and take here the situation could have involved kids in some way um like you could have had children with this person. Thank you. The Nine of Swords. Hmm. Are you picking another path? Because I see in the back. The Nine of Swords is, is a lot of worry, right? Stress. Anxiety. Somebody's doing a lot of thinking here in the background. Um, could be a Virgo, could be somebody that you're dealing with online, but somebody's really stressed in here that something's over. Like that, it hurt. It, um, it caused a lot of pain, so now they're very much in their head about it. For some, you could be making the choice to move forward and, like, leave one thing behind. Um, because it's almost like... With this choice... I, um, there's, there's something that it's like you're moving forward to manifest and it's paying, it's looking like it's paying off for you there with the six of pentacles, but, um, 
You got somebody here still very much in their head here. It's like you're fighting for what you want here, but with doing that may upset some people. If that makes sense. Show me what they're manifesting. The wheel. Change. You're growing. You're changing. You're expanding. The Queen of Wands at the bottom. That's Aries, Leo, Sag energy. But it's looking like you're feeling good about that. You could have a couple of people trying to get your attention here. The wheel is a card um, of good luck, fate, destiny. So it looks like you're following your destiny. But there may be somebody in the background there um, really worried about losing you. All right, Capricorn. So this could go a couple of different ways for a couple of different people. Um, you know, because it could have to do with like... Um, for some like a parent situation there could have been a marriage here um for some there's just something that's taken off incredibly quick like it didn't work out something didn't work out i don't i feel like whatever you're going to there's some type of like um i don't know if it's like regret remorse behind it but it's also like very freeing for you and it's destined for you so you're moving forward to manifest possibly with like a past person or, or a friend um, from childhood or something like that but whatever you're doing is creating some type of flow for you and that could be cash flow but for some it feels like with this choice there's something that is kind of just there sitting being maybe left and you know that that does seem to put someone very much in their head hurting worried kind of wrapped up in that all right capricorn i hope this helped if it resonated please make sure that you like and subscribe below if you guys like to contact me for a personal reading that information is below as well you guys take care and i'll see you next time bye